Hi, I'm Simon Daniels. I uh, work for Microsoft, also on the A-Type-I board, country delegate for the USA, general troublemaker on type of file, that kind of thing. I'm the lead program manager for fonts and UX solutions, which is a new job. Uh, recently got reorged, and now I, my team is responsible for the icons and the visual uh, backgrounds and um, wallpapers and stuff in Windows. So oh. I've got a slightly bigger team now. Okay. But we do fonts for everyone at Microsoft, branding, Xbox, Zoom, um, Windows, Office. I went to Reading to study psychology and sociology and uh, typography was kind of in of interest to me. I um, and I did it kind of as a side course. One of the uh, professors thought that I had kind of some kind of aptitude for typography and asked me if I wanted to switch, and I did. Right now, we obviously support the EOT, the Embedded Open Type Format, and there's no plans to take that away. We, um, we know there's some bugs, so we're working to try and resolve those bugs, and they may be fixed in a service pack. Um, ahead of the next version of IE, but we're, we're working on that. Then we are obviously very interested in WAF, um, the, the WAF format. And really my message here is to try and talk to as many font people as I can, as many foundries and type designers, to kind of get a gauge of what people's feelings are around that. We want to, we want to take our lead from what the font community wants. And so we're not gonna just jump on board with WAF until we know that it's got legs and it's what that there's going to be fonts available in that format. I have a slide that says the war's over um, but not completely convinced of that but what it does mean is we've got we've got to kind of win the piece. Uh, now we've got to build some fonts um, so the, rend the whole rendering issue is what really what we've got to focus on and I know that's was the subject of David's talk, um, and that's going to be a lot of work. It's not going to be uh, just dropping the typical print font on the web and hoping for the best. Um, there are so many target platforms. It's not just Windows, Mac, but you've got all these devices, you've got all these phones, ebook readers, uh, TV, set-top boxes, um, games consoles, portable media players, uh, games, uh, portable game devices. And they're all going to have browsers, and they're all going to be rendering type and uh, targeting those environments and getting type to look good on all those devices is hard enough when you control it. When it's coming in from the web, it's going to be very interesting. So. Oh, absolutely more. I've got a slide in my deck that says, um, back at A-Type-I last year, things were looking pretty grim. It looked like we were going to get raw fonts only. Um, it looked like there was going to be very little um, uh, opportunities for commercial fonts in that space. And things have changed drastically in the last year. Their business model has emerged that's separate from the font community through the uh, Typekit people. Um, but obviously they're part of the community now. They can't, they can't, they're not on the sidelines anymore. Um, that, I think, is a, was one of the major things. Um, now, they, they have demonstrated that there is a business model around, around fonts on the web. Um, the other thing that changed, I think, is the, the obviously the WAF format, that that kind of a compromise format that's come out of the browser and the type design communities. The IKEA stuff was great in that it identified to kind of corporate customers, clients, that um, building a brand around the default fonts may not be such a great idea. Um, and your yeah. your uh, uh, Flickr name is I Love Verdana. Yeah. You've gotten a lot of flack for that, especially no, recently. Not at all. Actually, I've got a lot of support. People have um, come to me and and 
said how unfairly Vedana and Matthew have been treated. Um, and it's, yeah, it's been interesting. But I've, no, I've not, I've not had any flack. I've actually had lots of supportive comments about it. And I haven't changed my, uh, my Flickr or Hotmail account still. <laughs> okay. I love Vedana. Um, so yeah, I'm really optimistic.